In previous videos, we've tested out new features of the updated Movavi Unlimited, but everything we did was rather trivial common. Today, I want to show you how much more creative you can get. Creative approach to these elements will make your videos much more memorable and impressive. And as we all know, an impressed viewer almost always means a new subscriber. Editing and creating a video is not as difficult as you think. Of course, bringing some ideas to life requires a lot of experience and time, but I'm sure that with the right tools, everyone can do something unusual in less than five minutes. And there is no better tool to prove my point than Movavi Unlimited. Designed specifically for beginners, it successfully combines advanced features in a user-friendly, intuitive app. This software pack updates regularly and each update brings users more and more new, exciting features. And today's video tutorial, if you may, will use such new features to their fullest. I think we should start with something I call Call the talking head effect. This text effect is perfect for educational, historical, and news-like channels. Well, wherever you need to add a quote, this effect is for you. To create it, you will need four files. A video for the background, a picture of a quoted character with a closed mouth, with an open one, and a text bubble. The first and last files on the list are quite easy to get, but what about the second and the third? Don't worry, I'll show you how to turn a simple image into animation frames in a minute or so, to do this, we will use Movavi Photo Editor, which is part of the Movavi Unlimited package. Movavi Unlimited brings together the best of Movavi in one accessible and intuitive platform, video editing, photo editing, screen recording, file conversion, etc. And now, let's get started. Launch Movavi Photo Editor and open our original image. I will use this photo of Albert Einstein. It's black and white, but that's not a problem. The latest version of the photo editor can intelligently colorize images. To colorize our photo, click on Old Photo Restoration. The app suggests restoration colorization by default, but restoration here isn't needed since the photo is in good resolution and has no artifacts. Turn off the Restore switch and click Apply. In a few seconds, the neural network will analyze the photo and return color and life to boring black and white photos. Here is the photo after the first run. It already looks much better, but I feel like coloring it twice will do no harm. Harm. Let's repeat the procedure again. Now the image looks much closer to reality. Now we must remove the background. Go to the Remove Background tab and select Automatic Removal. And boom! Done! Even in the current state, the photo can be used, but I want a little bit more from it. I will repeat the process a couple more times. Now save the image as PNG. If you don't change the extension from JPEG to PNG, all your removed background will go white. Only PNG supports transparency. Okay, we're halfway done. Moving on. Now we need to make the mouth seem open. Go to the Insert Image tab, turn on a rectangular selection, and select the area of the mouth and chin. Copy the selection selected part by clicking on this button, next delete the selected area by clicking delete, all that's left is pasting back the copied image like so, adjust the position and voila! Save this image as well, okay now we have everything we need for our animation. The final part is the easiest one, editing everything. Open mobile video editor and import the files. First let's drag and drop a background video of me on the timeline, create an additional video track for the talking head and play place there a photo of Einstein with his mouth closed. To adjust the size, right-click on the clip and in Tools, select Position. For this animation, both frames must be the same size, and the easiest way to do this is to select Picture in Picture. Drag the head to a position and you're done. First frame should be rather short, so let's trim the duration a bit. Repeat the same process for the second frame. When the two images are in position, it's time to add a text bubble. I have downloaded mine from the internet and removed the background in Movavi Photo Editor. Text bubble must be on a separate video track. Create one more and drag and drop our text bubble there so that it appears simultaneously with the second frame of the animation. Edit the size and position to your liking. The final touch is adding text. Go to the text tab and select simple text. My Einstein will introduce himself, so I'll simply write I am Einstein in black letters. Position the text in the bubble and you're done. Here's our final final result. Five minutes and we get an interesting effect on our hands. If you want, you can add more frames of the animation to make it look like Einstein is talking all the time. Personally, I think this is a very creative way to reveal quotations, turning dull, boring 
elements into something memorable and pleasing to the eye. What do you think? Write your opinion in the comments below. By the way, the new features are also available for Movavi Unlimited, so hit the link in the description to learn more about a special offer from Movavi Vlog. And in video production, it's not all about the editing. The quality of videos themselves matters. No matter which camera you use to shoot, having an external monitor is extremely useful, especially for one-person studios. But big monitors cost a lot and may not be a worthy purchase at the beginning of your YouTube journey. But the solution exists, it's in your pocket. You already have a phone with a big, bright, high-res screen, so why not just use that? Not all phones can be directly connected to a big camera, and that's exactly the type of problem the Axun Cineview Simo is solving. This little device allows you to turn your iPhone or iPad into a monitor that works as good as professional monitors. All those cameras have small displays with low resolution, brightness, and color accuracy. Your phone, however, is just the right size so it would be perfectly usable and comfortable. It takes only a few seconds to set it up, connect one cable to the device, one to the camera, and insert the battery. Then open a free app and enjoy crisp 1080p footage with almost no latency. The app allows you to record videos directly on your phone in H.264 codec at 1080p 60 frames per second and with variable bitrate. With this thing, you can save tons of space in your backpack and give you more creative freedom. Regardless of what you're shooting, such a device will always come in handy. So click the link below to learn more about Axun Cineview Simo. The second effect will also be quite funny. I want to make the like hide behind the objects on the table and then appear on the screen. Basically, I want to bring some life into it. This effect may seem confusing as it requires two videos to be created before composing the final video. Just follow my lead and you will see that such an effect can be done in a couple of minutes. Let's use this video of me sitting at the table. First, we'll create the top layer video using an image of green color. Just Google green and use any one you like. Import a video and a green image into your project, then create a second video track and drag and drop the file so that the green color is on top. Now adjust the position and the angle so that the green color covers the entire area of the future animation. In my case, it's everything on the left of the laptop. Export the file as a separate video. OK, now open an empty project and drop our original video onto the timeline. Next, go to the stickers and look for the heart. With stickers, you can highlight the main ideas, important details, and give additional information. The tracking function allows you to attach text and stickers to moving objects. When you found a sticker you like, just drag it onto the timeline. To add animation, go to the moment the sticker appears, and in animation, select advanced. As you select this option, two keyframes will appear. They look like small dots on the timeline with an arrow in between. Right now there are only two of them and they show the start and end of the animation. I want the like to be shy at first and jump into the frame later. With this idea in mind, I'm adjusting the sticker's size and position on the first keyframe so it would be close to the border of the laptop. The second keyframe will be the like picking over the edge. To continue animating, we need more keyframes, which can be added by clicking on add keyframe. Next, specify find the steps of our animation and syncing them with hand gestures. Then just export a separate video. And now, as you may have guessed, it remains only to combine two videos into one. Let's import our two videos into a new project, create a second video track and drag the video onto the timeline so that the video with green color is on top. Now right click on it and in tools select chroma key. Click on the green color and that's it. Here's the video we've got. It's a bit choppy, not gonna lie, but for a two minute work, it turned out really great. The beauty of this idea is that you can animate anything this way, text, images, even videos. While I was preparing the footage, I came across a video of a girl singing Hallelujah that got 10 million views. Beautiful song and a girl with a constantly changing background. If you wanna do the same trick in your videos, then Movavi Video Editor is exactly what you need. With video editors built in smart background, 
background removal, anyone can make their video more colorful and interesting. AI background removal will help you waste less time on creating stunning videos. In addition, the use of artificial intelligence guarantees fast and high quality results. Here is a short guide. Import the video with a person and the background videos. In my case, there will be two of them, the beach and the meadow with horses. Palmin, right? Create a second additional video track and place the video with the singer on the top layer. Trim background videos so that the transition happens approximately in the middle of the video. Right click on the clip, tools, background removal, select precise and click remove. Wait a few seconds and here is the result. As you can see, removing the background is a piece of cake with Mobile Video Editor. And the last effect for today will be especially useful for everyone who does not have a studio. We've all lived in houses with loud neighbors. A drill, a washing machine, a hairdryer, a vacuum. All those noises make it simply impossible to record something. Sometimes even with professional equipment, recording in noisy environments is problematic. Not everyone has the opportunity to insulate a room or rent a separate studio. So if you are recording at home surrounded by noise, Movavi Video Editor's smart noise removal feature will definitely come in handy. Let's take this video for example. You've decided to record a YouTube video, but in the meantime, someone has decided to dry their hair, cook a meal, and listen to music. The video needs to be recorded right now, so the best way out is to get rid of noise in Movavi. The voice can be heard, but background noises make this video simply awful and unusable. To fix this noisy problem, open the video editor, import the video, and drag it onto the timeline. Right click and in tools, select noise removal. By default, the program will select AI noise removal, so just click apply. Artificial intelligence will quickly separate the voice from noise, leaving a clear sound without distortion. Just listen to the results. You've decided to record a YouTube video, but in the meantime, someone has decided to dry their hair, cook a meal, and listen to music. The video needs to be recorded right now, so the best way out is to get rid of noise in Movavi. Much better, the voice is heard clearly, the noise is gone, and my ears don't hurt anymore. But we will go even further and use this noise reduction to create a concentration effect. To do this, we must save the noise-free video as a separate file, then create an empty project and an additional video track in it. Drag two videos onto the timeline, which video will be on the top layer doesn't matter. Now trim the noisy video and we repeat the same thing with our noise-free video. Let's add a sound to enhance the effect. I have already downloaded it. Just import it and drag onto the timeline. Quick syncing so the sound peaks when we switch videos and you're done. Here is the result. You've decided to record a YouTube video, but in the meantime, someone has decided to dry their hair, cook a meal, and listen to music. The video needs to be recorded right now, so the best way out is to get rid of noise in Movavi. I think it's a creative way to deal with noises. So as you can see, editing creative videos with Movavi Unlimited is easy. Just try out and see for yourself. With Movavi Unlimited, everyone can create stunning videos that get millions of views. Don't forget that the idea is the key. Leave its implementation to Movavi Unlimited. Smash that like button if this video was helpful to you and interesting to watch. Write in the comments which effect you liked the most. Subscribe to the channel so you won't miss new video tutorials. Good luck and see you in the next one.